During a recent speech commemorating the anniversary of his ascension to the throne in 1999, King Mohammed VI, who is 59 years old, expressed his prayers and wishes for a resumption of normal relations between the two countries and their peoples. The borders have been shut down since 1994, leaving families separated following Morocco's accusation that Algeria was involved in a jihadist attack on a Marrakesh hotel resulting in the death of two tourists. As a response, Algeria sealed its frontiers. Tensions between the neighboring rivals have been persistent, further fueled by their long-standing dispute over the Western Sahara region. The Algeria-backed Polisario Front has been seeking independence from Morocco's rule over the territory and has declared it a war zone. In August 2021, Algeria officially cut diplomatic ties with Morocco, citing hostile act from its neighbor a move that Morocco deemed completely unjustified. Adding to the complexity of the situation, Israel's recent recognition of Morocco's sovereignty over the Western Sahara further exacerbated the tensions between Morocco and Algeria. The latter criticized Israel's move, labeling it a fragrance violation of international law. In his nationally broadcasted speech, King Mohammed VI aimed to provide reassurance to the Algerian people, their leadership, and their brothers in Algeria, stating that there is no reason for them to fear any malicious intentions from Morocco. It is worth noting that the king has consistently called for a rapprochement with Algeria on an annual basis, showing a desire to mend the strained relations between the two nations.